Looking for the ten inch child. <laughs> and we're live. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect timing. Yeah, way to start it off, Sean, talking about 10-inch child. <laughs> I didn't say the child's ready for my 10 inches. <laughs> <laughs> and we're still live. <laughs> what is up, everybody? Ugh. <laughs> oh, just, goodness. I just want to make sure. One moment. Interesting question. That's what? my phone. Oh, <laughs> okay. Surrey thinks what? I have an interesting question. What? One moment. <laughs> Um, hello everybody. We are taking a break from a Friday pops and shots. Uh, this is just a Brittany coughing fest. What, what is the thumbnail? I don't know. I didn't even see what it was. It's like Brian partying. <laughs> he just looks like he's sideways. <laughs> um, so we're just kind of hanging out. We're going to open up our chalice box tonight. Um, we will still do stupid stuff if you pay us, but we're not taking shots. <laughs> yeah. I'll drink. <laughs> <laughs> um, we'll be back at it, I'm sure, next week on Sean's channel. And then the week after, we'll be back to the normal thing. We're actually talking about potentially uh, throwing in some gift cards as well as the giveaways this next go round. No, so. as the giveaways. Yeah, we'll figure it out. <laughs> I said, let's do gift cards so we don't have to do shipping. And now he's all like, no, we're going to do both. <laughs> yeah, well, we'll see. <laughs> we'll get there when we get there. So, let's Bri see. Brian's that. giving away a PlayStation. No, <laughs> no, he's not. Definitely not doing that. Sean's giving away a 10 inch child. <laughs> Giving away the ten inches to the child. <laughs> <laughs> That's probably what Surrey picked up on. The FBI is going to show up at my house. <laughs> it was Bartney. <laughs> so let's say hello. Uh, Elaine was first in, followed by Mr. Funko Illuminati, Pop Epidemic, Tasha, Justa, the child. <laughs> What's up, Mama J? <laughs> hello, Sin. <sighs> Uh, uh, hello, Tasha. I think I said you already, but yeah. whatever. Um, hello, Joe. Uh-oh, Joe's here. Hey, LJ, Kenneth. What's up, Tickles? Happy uh, birthday, Tickles. Happy birthday, Tickles. Even though it's months since then. Hello, The Variety Show. Tickles hey, wouldn't Tickles. sing One Piece songs with me the other night. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Megan. Hey, Kiwi Couple. Hi, Kiwi. Uh, let's see here. Da, da, da. Hello, Fritzy Funko, Tyrone, Jeremy, Waylon, Tia. I do not exist. Hello, Devin. What's Hi, up, Alice? Hello, Devin, you're an asshole as well. Uh, Hen hello. Dog. What's up, Zach? Hen, we got your box. We opened it up. Thank you very much. The That's video will be coming eventually. Eventually, <laughs> we have a lot of videos that we're very behind on. Hello, Scott. Hi, Campbell's collecting. Hello, Brian Henry. Hello, Cat Go Lightly. What's up, Robert? Hello, Zombie Recon. Is Larry here? Uh, I have not seen, seen Larry. Hi, Sean Lindsay. If he will, that's that's Bob. Um, and it just sped up. Yeah. So, hello, Peanut Butter and everybody. And if we missed you. Yes. Uh, Brent, David, Lab Jar, Possible Purpose, Nightshade. Carry in. So, uh, who sent stuff from Amazon to my postal box? Oh, not us. I keep getting stuff from Amazon and it has no name on it, just says Amazon Fulfillment Services. That's awesome, though. It's like a surprise. It's heavy. <laughs> <laughs> Is it ticking? Hey, DJ, DJ Funko no. Pop Hunter. Hello, Sarah. Quick draw. Hello, Dwayne Lee. Guzzy. Hey, LJ. Hawaiian Pop. Hello, Stephen. All right. And I think I said hello, Justin, already. Yeah. So I think we're caught up. If not, hello. Yes, hello to anybody that we have missed. I've been messing with my training at work so hard that just reminded me. When when she answers 911 calls and nobody's on the other line, like a hang up or something, she's like, hello. Hello. And so I'm in like way on the other side of the room and I'm like, hello. <laughs> and she'll be like, hello. And I'll be like, hello. 
<laughs> She'll start laughing on 911 calls. She's like, stop it. What's up, Grump? I can't Hello, help but mess box. with her, though. Yes, we did get our box, Daniel. Thank you. That is in a video as well. Yes. We are that far behind. John finally caught up with us and got the orange Marvin, as you can see behind him. Or, or yellow. Could be yellow. It's also green. <laughs> <laughs> Sean, did you get the 10 inch Deadpool? Somebody said. No. No, I, I don't want those. No. He just wants the 10 inch child. Yep. yep. The child. I'm, I'm telling you, I want every single one of those pops. So, what up, Grumpy? We have our chalice box and we have a snack crate from Australia. Australia. Yeah, me too. I can't I can't do Australian every time I try. Thanks, Thanks hen dog. I like um, the child. Daniel would like to know, Sean, did you get your box? Uh, I didn't go to the P.O. box this week. I don't think those ladies are going to like me very much when I show up. You need to take a trailer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because I bought it. But, but I don't... I'm opening this thing. I don't know what it is. I've been here for like a week. Well, thank you very much, Tickle My Hole 420. Oh, that's lovely, Joe. What? Tickle My Hole? Oh. I, I enjoy your name. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> now is the tickling of the hole only during 420 and is it a time or date hey Johnny <clears throat> I think this is awesome what is it it's a Broly oh is it it's a very heavy Broly and are you sure you didn't order it uh, if I ordered it it wouldn't go to my P.O. box and it also wouldn't say Sean Ryan Oh, yeah, true. <clears throat> so, whoever ordered this is awesome, because I think it's the bigger version of this. Hello, Kristen. What did they post? Fugitive Toys just dropped a $10 mystery box, no common pops, retired chase, and exclusives. That's actually pretty good for $10. bucks. It's not bad. I think I've spent all of my credit on mystery boxes this week. <laughs> you have mystery box credit? <laughs> credit cards. <laughs> yeah. Ah. I was about to say, damn, sign me up. Uh, so whoever sent the Broly, thank you. Yeah. It's super heavy compared to the little one, but it's the same dude, right? Looks the same. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Just the larger version. Yeah, I don't know who's. Oh, oh. <laughs> pops with purpose says the surprise is out of the bag. It was for the gift exchange, Sean. Ow! <laughs> but how am I supposed to know that? <laughs> there's still there a piece of paper. No, there's nothing. It's just straight from YouTube. Oh wow! Or, I mean, Amazon. I was like, damn, YouTube sends stuff too. Well, hey, well, JJ. Well, now I know who who got my name, and uh, I'll redo that in a video. <laughs> so thank you michael that's that's actually really cool i was just super confused so did anybody do any black friday shopping yeah we did word but not very much yeah we did get some mystery boxes not a fifteen hundred dollar one <laughs> Tape it back up hit rewind <laughs> no we did not purchase the fifteen hundred dollar uh Box. Fugitive Toys mystery box that was up, sold out, then went back up again and sold out again. We did get a, a Tiny Ghost mystery box, a Fig Pin mystery box, because it was five Fig Pins for 50 bucks, which is just a good deal, because they were all regular and extra large. But mm. And we got the seven bucks a pop boxes. Okay, that other box goes with it, because there is another box here that came about the same time with the same situation. So I will check that out. Uh, hello, baby Yoda doo 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 doo, <laughs> aka Robert Breaks YouTube. Baby Yoda doo 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 doo, doo baby Yoda doo doo. doo. <laughs> uh, Tats, I did not order the Chrome Goku Funimation um, exclusive because there's probably fifty thousand of them. 
none of their chrome sell out, so it'll still be there. And if it if it's not there, then it will restock. Zach, it's called Black Friday because it's racist. Whoa. <laughs> Taking an awkward turn. <laughs> Just a little bit. No. He said, why is it called Black Friday? No, I don't know why it's called Black Friday, actually. Uh, it's a religious thing, isn't it? I don't think so, because it's... Uh, I don't think so. I don't think so, because it's... Uh, <laughs> I don't think so? Yes. Follow my logic. Well, Stay with me. I've learned something today. <laughs> Good. To learn that Brittany doesn't know what the hell she's talking about. <laughs> yes. Uh, because you'll die over a flat screen. Yeah, people are stupid. As you can see, uh, the Chrome, good Lord, that's bright, is still available. Yeah, it'll be available. And it will be. Chrome so, said the Fugitive box went up three times, but it was only 32 boxes total. I don't know how he knows that, but that's what he said. Doesn't who said that? Grump. No, that doesn't make a lot of sense. Um, I've been doing a lot of holiday drinking, <laughs> and I'm looking at my credit card bills. <laughs> <laughs> I won't look at mine. Uh, so I bought. You bought a seven hundred and fifty dollar box last night. Yes. Maybe did Chalice have a three hundred dollar box up? Who? Chalice? Did they do three hundred? They had a two hundred dollar box. A one hundred dollar box. Fifty dollar boxes. And thirty five. How do we? Wait a minute. I thought I bought two of the two hundreds. We got a fifty dollar one because I like the um, grails in it. I got three fifties. Two one hundreds. I thought I got two two hundreds, but I don't understand this charge. It's three oh six oh two. That doesn't make any sense. Maybe I had money in PayPal. Maybe that's what it is. Probably. Devin said he'll buy the seven fifty box from you. There were only five of them, right? Bought a seven fifty from Spastic. I bought fifteen hundred from Fugitive. I bought a three hundred from Fugitive. This is all in one card that I like never use. I must have been like, ah, that'll be perfect. <laughs> $3,600 in charges in the last 48 hours. Uh, that's, yeah, good, uh, that's a good credit card company to not say a damn thing about that. Uh, yeah, because one of my other ones, uh, I tried to order a Christmas gift and they rejected the charge and it sold out. Bro. Ooh. I was like, great. That sucks. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Because I, what I did is I tried to ship it to the person, so I used their name. Oh. Hi. Yeah, I put my billing info in and somebody else's address and name for the shipping, and they rejected it. That sucks. They're giving away a bunch of stuff, AJ. Yeah, they are. I saw that. Let's see. Yeah. Sorry for Kazi squeaks. Nah, it's That's fine. Okay. An Australian energy drink. What oh, you guys have to drink with yours. We can, yeah. I was just pulling the drink out. Isn't it like six bucks extra? Oh, guess what's in I don't know how much it is extra. Is it a violet crumble? Yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what that is. It's, it's a, delicious. It's a delicious candy bar. It's like the crunchy, but it's thanks for the toy, Andrew. <laughs> Sean. What? <laughs> no, we didn't get anything from Big Apple. We still are a little leery. Yeah. We're not quite ready to go that way yet. Yes, that is the toy Andrew bought, Kazi. Yes, Fritzy. It'll make you jump higher than a kangaroo. Crikey. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> yes. So, so, yeah, we just have a snack crate and a chalice box. And, you know, chit chat. Patty Whack. Hey, pop couple. Okay, yeah, the first one I had uh, money in PayPal, so that's why it's a weird charge. <laughs> so I did get two 200s also from Chalice. So hopefully something good will come out of all those boxes. Yeah. Hi. That's weird. <laughs> yeah. So. 
<laughs> it, well, normally, oh, there it is. Wasn't showing that at first. Oh, my Paco will. Hello. Hello, Chad and Captain Flannel's Saucy Time. I like the channel name. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> I like it. I, I definitely like it. <coughs> Uh, I thought I saw another one up here. The Nerd Bar. Hello, the Nerd Bar. Yes. Why are you barking at that? Will a grod pop for 10 bucks? That's a good well, party. you know, Plastic Empire, because it's right there where you're at, Robert, that's probably awesome. But I will honestly say we will never buy another Plastic Empire mystery box again. Why? Because it's a bit nothing but... That's where I got my Sean. From Sean of the Dead. That was the first time we bought from them, right? Yeah. And every time we've been since then? That was the only time we've bought. We've bought, we've bought in two mystery boxes from them since then. No, we haven't. Yeah, you have. No. <laughs> <laughs> I can even look. I'm going to look and see who's right. Yes. Uh, if you guys have not seen the... All Might Glow, the weekend All Might Glow is pretty friggin' sick. Yes. That is probably the best glow ever. Look, order confirmed, on its way, out for delivery. One time. That's the only time. Look. No, you're full of crap. Yo, you guys have done Plastic Empire through Amazon is what you've done. Yeah, through Amazon. Yeah, those are the poo-poo boxes, Brian. Yeah. Yeah, still crap. <laughs> The normal Plastic Empire boxes, I think, are $10, and if you buy, like, eight of them, you get free shipping. Yeah. They're not bad. I will say, uh, Plastic Empire does a great job shipping the pot, shipping the uh, Tiny Ghost. Or the Chomps, rather. Excuse me, the Chomps. Yeah. Oh, did you guys get the Tiny Ghost today? Uh, we got the Tiny Ghost mystery box. Yeah. We did, I didn't really care about... I didn't like the design on the other one. I got that one. So, JJ, you're asking, was there a guaranteed value for the Fugitive or the Spastic box? Neither put one, but I'm pretty sure both of those companies are going to hook it up. Yeah. So here's what you got to understand. Just because they don't say there's a guaranteed value doesn't mean that there isn't going to be a guaranteed value when it comes to certain companies. It's going to destroy their reputation if there's not. Um, yeah. Fugitive Toys, uh, like Pop Couple said, Last year, people who got bought the thousand dollar box got fifteen hundred dollars in value. Um, Curtis, as far as I know, has never sent out a mystery box that he didn't say was going to potentially be under value. Um, if it's going to be under value, he'll tell you there's a good chance this is a what does he call them? YOLO boxes. Oh, garbage. Yeah, yeah. you know what I mean? Where it's like you're buying a fifty dollar box that you may get 30 bucks from. Hey, you're good, Justa. Have a good night. Yeah. Night, good night. Yeah, like Grump said, Fugitive's probably going to be $17.50. Or they're, yeah, I don't know. High risk. Yeah, he usually will tell you it's high risk at, over at uh, Spastic Pops or Spastic Collectibles. Curtis will. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, um, but yeah, the glow on that Weekend All Might, have you seen it yet, Sean? Yeah, I like it. Dude. Yeah. I'm sorry. I love this pop. But the glow is nowhere close to what's going to be on that one. Nope. <laughs> nowhere close. Yeah. it's I, I totally foresee a huge line at Box Lynch. And I will be there picking mine up. And JJ's. Yeah, because JJ asked if I would pick it up for him. Uh, so. And that'll be Sunday. That's just weird. And our mall doesn't open until noon. Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> but what did, okay, did everybody see the um the sneak peek pop for the bundle tanker tinker bell? Yeah. Does it make anybody want to buy the bundle more? No. <laughs> no. I'm sure there's plenty I, of Disney people out there who will like it. Yeah. Yeah. But I mean, of all the pops to show. They're not going to give away the fire right off the right at the beginning. Yeah. They said there's going to be one 10 inch. They showed what the 10 inch was going to be. 
and they and they said they were going to show to the Funko Club members one pop that was going to be in it, and it was the Tinkerbell with the Santa hat on. Yeah. So, I'm just still curious as to how much this bundle is going to be. Because if it's over 200 bucks, I'm not getting it. It's going to be probably like 225 shifts. Yeah. Sorry, squeegees. It's fine. Uh, did I see the cell metallic T box from? FYE, I didn't know FYE actually did a cell metallic tea box because ours was at GameStop. Not cell, it's Piccolo. Yeah, well, yeah, I know they had a Piccolo, the arm, the one armed Piccolo, the metallic. the metallic Piccolo. You haven't seen it? The one armed one? Yep. Where he's doing the, what you call it? No. Need to pay attention. Someone on IG suggested 195 plus shipping, and that is assuming it's 11 regular pops, no two packs, etc. I think that was Serlant pops, yeah. Piccolo, yes, Piccolo. special beam cannon. Now I got to try to find a picture of it. Here it is. Well, yeah, yeah, he is one armed, but he's not doing the thing. Oh, well, that's he's firing it. Yeah. Yeah, FYE was Piccolo GameStop was uh so. I didn't yeah. know it was a uh pop and tea combo. Uh, I think it is. Yeah. It doesn't say it is. Huh. I don't know. Yes, we bought two Marvel GameStop boxes. Um we got one that we wanted and yep. one that we didn't. And one that we didn't care about. So it'll eventually be up for grabs or giveaway or something. I am not seeing the $10 boxes on Fugitive. So Grumpy is saying 11 times 15 equals 165 plus whatever the cost of a 10 inch pop is. 30 bucks. So, so there's a good chance that it's about 195, 200 bucks plus whatever the shipping is. Too much. Unless they insert two packs or. That's Okay, so that to me it's not too much, and the reason why is because if this is the only way they're doing the twelve days this year is doing the bundle, there's not going to be a daily drop of everything. That's people are going to want stuff that came out of that box. No, okay, I, I'll tell you this. Think about Toy Tokyo bundle. The only way to get it was through Toy Tokyo. How Everybody many... knew what it was. Okay, still okay, but and everybody... nobody wants it, and nobody wants it. So they could, we could get it, and somebody could still not want it. <laughs> well, didn't that Warriors pop sit at like sixty dollars for a while because everybody wanted just the yeah, Warriors but pop. all the H and R puffin stuff ones. So I mean, yeah, that's not for me. Yeah, I'm telling you right now, out of the bundle, we probably wouldn't even want half of the ones that we'll end up getting. Me, I mean us. Because I know Ooh. right here. Okay, me. Uh, <laughs> last year, I only wanted like four of the 12 days. I'm not going to talk you guys into it one way or the other. I'm yeah. going to say I'm sure there are things in there that both of you are going to want. Like flocked Coca-Cola bear. Yep. And I'm sure a lot of it's going to show up in mystery boxes. They're sold listings for $800 zombie. And yes, I'm sure there are plenty of it will show up in mystery boxes, but a lot of it's going to push that guaranteed value up if it's the desirable stuff. Yeah. Yes. Uh, uh, well, I don't know that uh, he said that it was better than it has been in recent years. That was uh, what's his face on the uh, YouTube. Sully. That was Sully. Yeah. He thinks Sully everything said is like. <laughs> Yeah, Sully thinks everything's wonderful. Yeah, I mean, but he works for Funko. He's paid to think that. That's right. his job. Shit, if if Funko was paying me, I'd be saying everything with sunshine and rainbows out my butt too. Yeah, like <clears throat> too many chromes. Mm -hmm. so, somebody was trying to say something like, uh, I think it was Pop Drunk was going on about everybody's upset about all the chromes they're making, and then they make a metallic toucan, and everybody flips the hell out. Well, the metallic's different though. Yeah. Well, first of all, it's an ad icon. Yep. Second of all, metallic is different than chrome. 
Yep. Uh, I've heard of all. There's only a thousand of them, and a lot of them were taken by flippers via yep. box. Yes. Flippers and mystery box companies. You guys know who you are. Um, but yeah, there, there's many reasons that was different. Where? How do I get to it, Pop Couple? Because I can't even get. I can't even find the ten dollar. On fugitive. Yeah. Are you going to mystery boxes? No. No, she wasn't. But it's not on there either. Yeah, it is. It's right there. Ten dollar oh. Friday Grail mystery. I knew that. Shh. It's only one, huh? That's crazy. I can't do a video on just one box. <laughs> uh, it's one per order. Oh, they want to charge shipping out the yin yang. Well, they're probably already prepackaged. Yep. Hmm. What are the grails? Ugh, Andy Dwyer. Have Ochako. Don't want cream, green Batman. Have two cans there. No, I just like that it's all vaulted exclusives or what was the other one? Retired. Retired, which is vaulted. Yeah, there's a lot of five and six dollar exclusives though. <laughs> Why did it let me like not have to do this last time? Was shipping free on the bigger boxes? I feel like it was, which was nice. There we go. There's the PayPal link. Your yin yang is too tight. Your what? Sorry, Ritzy. <laughs> Ritzy says his yin yang is too tight. I don't want to know. Yeah, I got. Do you guys get the three hundred dollar one pop couple? I thought you were asking us. I was like, come on now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know better than that. I, well, I'm in a conversation with you guys, so I know what you get. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Pop Couple, I think, said they got the... 15 and the 300. Yeah. I don't... I probably shouldn't reveal their secrets. Did you get chalice boxes, Pop Couple? I'm assuming you got at least one of the gold boxes. The real question is, did Grumpy get boxes? Because it's been a while since I've seen a video with your cat screaming at you. <laughs> no chalice, okay. Okay, I got one. You want me to get two? Sure. This chalice box is from before Black Friday, obviously, because there's no way for it to have gotten here by now. And we don't live near a chalice store. Ooh, let's battle. Do you have one? I don't have a chalice box, but I could find a $50 box. Do it. Let's battle. <laughs> How many pops are in there? Six? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's a chalice box, so. I might only have four pop ones. What is wrong with you? Oh, hey, JJ, your money just. Paid for my fugitive ten dollar box. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> what did JJ send you money for? Uh, to pick up the glow all night. Yeah. So, obviously, if they sell out, we'll refund him the money. <laughs> but right now, I'm just gonna use it because it's sitting there. Here, this one looks like someone stabbed it, but does it work? I think it's a Toy USA fifty. Let me make sure. Well, that means we'll probably win because Toy USA fifty dollars boxes aren't great. Hey, Ian. Hello, Joan. You keep your opinions over there in in Birdney World, and I'm gonna kick your ass. <laughs> Sean, she just doesn't. She doesn't listen to our uh, our logic. You and I do a lot of talking about how the fifty dollars Toy USA boxes and the sixty dollars Toy USA boxes are usually just kind of meh. It's when you get into the hundred dollar. Toy USA boxes where it gets better. Well, I don't even know <laughs> where this box is. I'm going to try to see if I can find which chalice box this was, like what the grails were. All right, this is a $50 box. So yeah, what I'm looking for is what the possibilities were. <laughs> Most was the one with the possibility of the glow in the dark. Doc Brown. Doc Brown. Glow in the glow in the dark dark brown. 
<laughs> dark, Go dark. in the dark, dark brown, damn it. Lisa did that too on a video. That's why I was laughing <laughs> at it. It's hard to say. <laughs> Glow in the dark brown. Uh, Joe, are you? You must be talking about seven bucks a pop. Uh, what's his face? What's his name? Lee. Lee. Lee actually commented last night and said that he was going through each order individually and making sure that they were not bot orders. The He's not he playing. He he. He does not. He does not like the bots. His system is supposed to be set up to stop the bots. Every he's time talking about that, or he's talking about um, the metallic toucan. Every time you, uh, this is the box I have. Ah, one in fifteen shot at the elephant. I thought you have that elephant. I do. <laughs> I also have Bobby and Neo, but I don't have. Ghostface. Ghostface. I want Ghostface. Besides, there were only 15 boxes, and these six pops were in those boxes. Was it, was this one of the 12-day boxes? Uh, no, you see it was like uh, right afterwards. Miss out on the $500 box. One more damage box. Uh, that $500 damage box is the one that I'm putting the video out tomorrow. I pull a very, very rare pop. Huh. You got Neo for 10 bucks. Nice. Nice. Where's Joe Jay? We're supposed to be making a deal, Jay. <laughs> you have Ghostface? I don't have Ghostface. Wait, hold on. Yeah, I do. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> All right. Now you don't have to watch. Correct. I know what JJ got out of the five hundred dollar box. JJ got a five hundred dollar box. Yes, yes, Pop Couple. That is also my eggplant face. <laughs> Just keep your head up. Will you stop telling me where to put my head? <laughs> Sean's like secretly giggling. <laughs> no. Okay, first pop from our box. Captain Marvel from Endgame. <laughs> Meh. 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 Um, yeah, so JJ ruined the fact that somebody else pulled the Arlia for me, Joe. Oh, That's no. That's why you haven't seen me open that box. In a group chat, too, JJ. What's wrong with you? Was there anybody we knew that pulled it out? No. I hate that it pulls up all these. Oh, no data. No, somebody's yeah. selling it in a Facebook group for $2,100 after pulling it. Wow. Wow. Okay, Sean, you want to pull one? That He's wasn't like, you who ruined it? Oh. Oh, it was yeah. Ken. Oh, yeah, you're right. Sorry, JJ. It was Ken. Damn Ken. You have what? Four pops, Sean? Uh... Yeah. Okay. Okay. Well, we'll pull another one then. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right, fine. It was Ken. Ken screwed it up. Another Teddy Rick. Another Teddy Rick. I want Teddy Rick. Well, I'll put it in your box then. I want Teddy Rick Chase. Well, we don't got that one. <laughs> well, okay, keep opening pops. <laughs> I have a protector in a damage box. That's promising. Teddy Rick is 13. Captain Marvel did not have a value. So I'm not real sure how the hell he got a value to put it in a box. The only pop in the picture that has a protector on it, actually Chandler might have a protector on him, uh, is Ghostface that I can tell. Oh, you bastard. <laughs> Should I pull? Yeah. Ha! Ah. Oh, dibs! Wait, you need that, don't you, Brian? We thought we, we had thought we all done. of them, and we missed we that We realized one. we didn't have Sauron. Oh, but you collect Lord of the Rings too, Sean. Never mind. I have it. Yeah, he oh. has Sauron. Um, not trying to look. I was looking to... So it's got you know some box crinklage on the top right, but the front of it looks good. Uh, yeah, you guys will probably want that. The front looks fine. 
Yeah, yeah eleven dollars. It's eleven dollar pop. Right. Uh, yeah, I'll just stick it in your pile. Nice. Yeah, I'm. I'm trying to decide if I'm just gonna send you all your stuff with your Christmas stuff and just send a massive box, <laughs> or split it up into two. Because either way, it's gonna be either two big boxes or one massive box. I haven't figured it out for you guys yet either. Because I owe you pops right now. I have them all just sitting. I have like eight or ten that are just sitting for you guys as well. Yeah. Okay. Oh. I see a theme. What, Rick? I theme. Because we got Teddy Rick and now we got Wasp Rick. Yeah, whatever. I see a Rick theme. I haven't uh, watched any of the new season yet. No. I Maybe like your pops, I. though. Got a teddy bear and a wasp. I'll look up the values after we're done. I'm trying to do it right now. It's too Good difficult. Lord, it's heavy, too. It's pretty cool pop. Kind of creepy. But pretty cool. All right, Sean. Damn. Lisa's like tearing people apart. <laughs> uh, next pop. Red Knight. From Dark Souls, I think. Yeah. Yeah. With a price sticker on the front. Of nine eighty five. Yeah, who prices stuff at nine eighty five? <laughs> That's kind of cool looking. I mean, if nobody wants it, I'll keep it. Stupid price sticker. What are you doing? I was gonna look up the value, but I'm gonna wait till we're done. There's uh, a new hot topic Krampus. Yeah, where the kids actually in front of him. Oh yeah. Yeah. I Instead got his sticker back. off. Yeah, hey, you. And it actually has game art on the back and not a set of crap. Oh, cool. That's cool. Yeah. Rick and Morty's funny, zombie. It's yeah. Funny. It's super funny. I'm just waiting to pull my ghost face. Shut up, Sean. Oh, son of a. Mm, I just bought this. Stop buying commons. <laughs> Because my friend at work said if I got any extra Yule Ball Pop, she will buy them off of me. So, boom. Oh, well, then you're fine. Yeah. So, Fred Weasley. Yule Ball. All right. I'm pulling this thing. Oh, that's pretty cool. That That's a cool looking hole. Age of Ultron. <coughs> I have no idea if I have this. Oh, I do. <laughs> I do. Uh, he's, you, this box is not great. The pop looks good. The box is not great. <laughs> box does not look. No, not, so the front of it has like this little black stuff that happens sometimes. It's like gunky shit that gets on the box. Yeah. And then the, the back of it has some. some oh yeah. That's, that's a, that's an out of box Hulk. <laughs> he's he's yeah. not. He's not awful. The front's not creased or anything. It's just got that uh, black crap on the top of it. Yes, yeah. Robert. But the back is uh, the back is a no good. Even like pop is like, yeah, yeah. That is the Hulk that ate gas station sushi. <laughs> it's sick Hulk. It's because he's green, like super green. <laughs> and Pop Couple said hashtag Kaka on it. Yes. Why did Cody's pops always have poo poo? <laughs> I don't know. Right? <laughs> it's my turn. <laughs> I love when he was in the one live stream. He's like, it's not poo poo. <laughs> You're trying to make me pull this one? No, they're both right there. Okay, first pop in a protector. I always pull the better of the two. <laughs> Son of a. The another what? one you just bought? No. no, it's another one we just got rid of. It's not a bad pop. The people, who like, people who like that are like really obsessed with it. I gave it away. <laughs> like a thirty dollar pop. Yeah. J Balvin. Do you, you want to go again, or do you just want me to pull the ghost face? Just pull your ghost face. <laughs> you already looked in the box and saw it was ghost face, didn't you? It's not ghost face. It's, no, it's not. not. It's a no. It's the third one of these I've gotten recently. Bobby? It's not pictured. It's not a picture pop. Oh, I thought... Oh. Well, yeah, okay. Those were... Never mind. It is a good... 
really good box for this one, though. Bling. Oh, oh, the beast. It's the beast. The beast. And he's got a $35 price tag on him. I believe that's what that says. Yeah, you guys probably can't see that. No. That pop is so cute. 35. The beast. Uh, and I already have one in your pile, so this beast goes up for trader sale. I like dog pops. Can't help it. He's not. I mean, I wouldn't call him damaged. Mm -mm. There's no creases or dents or anything. So beast. I am not hopeful for whatever we're about to pull. I'm glad we didn't do a video of this one. <laughs> well, depending on what's coming out of the box, unless you saw what was in here. No, I didn't. Okay. I'm just guessing that's the higher value one. I hope not. Oh, the disappointment in Brian's face <laughs> says it all. Curse Mark Sasuke. Which, just when we thought our freaking luck had changed with Chalice. Just when we thought we got rid of all our Sasuke's. We decided to keep one because Brian started watching Naruto. But where'd that one come from? What box was that? I don't remember. A chrono, I think. Yeah. So, boo. <laughs> Take a shot. You'll feel better. Um, I mean, value-wise, you're still at like $75. Yeah, but... But he's at least. I want to know. I, I literally, you need to send Chalice a message asking him how he can send this when it has no value on Pop Price Guide. Because he's still got value in all this. It doesn't matter. It's a. I don't know. You guys are just haters. Yeah. Pain in my ass, man. So I win, right? I got beast. Well, of course, yeah, of course, because we got a bunch of. Poop. Wolves or dogs, Ken? I mean, we might have won value. Yeah. I, mean, I think you won value. But well, I don't know what that Hulk is worth. No, I don't either. I think Beast is like 30-something. Wasp rig. You want the Beast, Kristen? Yeah, just message me on Instagram. I'm looking at... Oh, it didn't come up that way. <laughs> what number is that Hulk? Uh, 68. It's a hot topic one. Uh, $13. Oh, all right. He's not crazy. Wasp Brick is $24? Crazy. Okay. Is he an exclusive? No. no. Mm, it's probably just craziness. Okay. <clears throat> Yeah, exactly, Grump. It's from Red New York. is ten dollars. Right, Teddy Rick is thirteen. I looked already. J Balvin, thirty-five dollars. I don't know how it's holding any value. Thirty. Thirty dollars. Because it retails on his website for thirty. Jeez. And cursed Mark Sasuke. You can probably just put cursed Mark. The Beast, $36. Just let me put, put Sasuke. $25. I just realized that that's drool on the ball and not fangs. Yeah. Remember? Because when they picked up the ball, it was like covered in drool. <laughs> yeah, I just thought those were teeth for some reason. Oh, exciting news. Guess what we have coming? An Gosh. entire case. A Funko Mystery Minis Anime Series 2. What's in there? Uh, a lot of Dragon Ball, Naruto, and One Piece Mystery Minis. Bleach. And Bleach. Yeah. Do you care about the condition, Lisa? Because you can have it. J Balvin is like some kind of Puerto Rican music dude, I think. I have no idea who J Balvin is. All I know is when I got the chase with the common, Anthony messaged me like right away. It was like, I need to have those. My wife is in love with that guy. Yeah. I was like, you, you got it. <laughs> Lisa says she doesn't care about the box condition. Oh, all right, cool. Yeah, all where, yours. Where so, is this? 
So those, those are spoken are for. They're coming from the UK. Oh. Uh, so I got I got four pops, and three of them are already spoken for. <laughs> and I get the red knight to go up here with Broly and Majin Vegeta. Why is it making me sign into Amazon? That's weird. Yeah, so Brittany was like, hey, they've got these full case of mystery minis for, what, 12 bucks? Or, I mean, uh, 60 bucks or something like that? No, it's forty nine ninety nine, free shipping, unopened case, and they don't sell those anymore. I mean, they're older, but... Where was it at? Amazon. Amazon. Oh. Yeah, so I'll pull up the picture here. Um, actually, Brian, you should probably... Sean, are you showing that? Uh, I'm looking for it. Is it this? Yes. So we have that whole case coming. Oh, it's Shonen Jump. So that's One Piece, um, Bleach, Death, uh, Note. Death Note, Dragon Ball, Naruto, and Dragon Ball. Yep. It's Tony Chopper. What's the freaking teddy bear's name in Bleach? Cone. Cone. There you go. I want that one. <laughs> I was going to say, if you guys get a cone, I want it. <laughs> There's only one that I don't know, and it's that guy behind Vegeta in the purple. This? I can't see what you're pointing at. The one my mouse is moving around on top of? Oh, Brian's got YouTube up instead of streaming. That's, um, That's Sasuke. Yeah. Oh. Then he's the first mark dude you guys just pulled. Yeah, uh, that's Sasuke when he's not uh, all whacked out. Goku's hair looks backwards. It might be. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Freaking um, Ichigo looks cool as shit. Uh, Want to know what I bought? What? Um, give me one, what's his name? Did you buy a friggin'... Uh, Did you buy his Bankai? No. Oh, no, you bought... Oh, did you buy a freaking... Oh, he's got a custom. Uh, it was in his Black Friday sale, I think. I bought this one. Oh, the Ichigo? Yeah. The, cr the metallic Ichigo. Yeah. That's cool. That's pretty awesome. Yes. I like that one. Speaking of metallic, the metallic Todoroki, not so good. This guy made a metallic glow in the dark one, I think. Well, here was the first yeah, right here. What was it? It's metallic and it's glow in the dark. So there's the metallic on his hair and stuff. Yeah. And then oh, the glow in the dark looks like that. That's awesome. So, yeah. Um, I'm going to take this off for just a second and show everybody this bullshit. Was that? They put the sticker They on. put a sticker on top of the friggin' pop box for that. Take it off. It's on there good. Yeah. I'm afraid of messing up the top part of the box. Well, I mean, what are you going to do? Go exchange it? No, it's from Amazon. Yeah. How much was the what, Jeremy? I'm assuming the custom. Uh, the Ichigo was 57 But the paint on him doesn't look as bad as some that people were showing on Instagram. Get it for me. With what? Your money. <laughs> <laughs> Brian's hidden money? He just got paid. I didn't. <laughs> uh, what are you showing? The horror series um, mystery minis that I've been coveting for years with Elvira and Slimer. and um, This is my screen that you just put back up. Yeah. The two... Um, the two from Beetlejuice and uh, I gave Larry another horror tin, and he out of box them because I he... saw I saw that 
two of the things I gave Larry for Christmas, he already had. You were able to peel yours off, Justin? Because mine looks like it's been like ironed on to the top of the box. Cosmo, stop licking your butt. Cosmo, keep licking your butt. <laughs> Cozzy, no butt licking. Zoe does that crap and it drives me insane. Yeah, what, so. What else am I supposed to do? Use a blow dryer, Brian. That's what Joe says. I have a heat gun. This is the ones that. Here. I don't know why we're doing this. And it's got Jaws with the tank in his mouth. And Regan from, or Reagan from um, Exorcist. Yeah. Three? Yeah. yeah I want Cone and Ichigo and Luffy and Ryuk. I want all of those as well. <laughs> what if we open? Larry, I can't find... The, the boxes you say you left for Kazi and Serene, dude. I don't know where they are. Hey, Slimer. Yeah. Is that... that oh, old... it's... What is that thing from Beetlejuice where he's got like the cone face? <clears throat> That's um Alec Baldwin. When, yeah. they str when he stretches his face and puts the eyeballs on his fingers. Oh. Also, in this same series, which I don't know why they don't have a picture, it has the Gina Davis one where her mouth's open. If you click that picture that's two over to the right, it has all the possible pulls. Oh, maybe she's not in this series. Maybe she's in series two. But I want the Elvira one. Larry, I don't even remember the box, dude. Larry's like, you took it and put it somewhere. I'm like, where? <laughs> where did I put it? Those mystery minis are forty four ninety nine for that whole case. See, if you wait a couple years, <laughs> you can get a case for really cheap. <laughs> wait until nobody wants them. <laughs> oh, she is. She's an exclusive, Larry says. I knew she was in that series. Thank you. Hot topic, says LJ. Mm. And she wasn't a mom. She hey, didn't Elizabeth. have any kids. Yeah, because weren't they were actually like? I'm sure she would like that, Brian. What and Brian Henry? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> what? He has an extra Elvira mini. If I want it. Oh. I said yes, please. <laughs> All right. So can I call dibs on extra cones, Luffy's, Ryuks, and Ichigo's? Yeah, we figured we'd probably send you the extras if we got doubles. Which I'm sure we will get doubles. I mean, hey, Anthony. I have the whole One Piece set, I think, including the $50 Luffy, which is insane. That a mystery mini is worth that much. There's a lot of mystery minis that are worth a lot. Yeah. There's a lot of, like, our, our uh, Chase Trap Draw Pez is worth $33. Why? Because it's a Chase Pez. Boo. 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 You know what? Let's put the poop back in the poop box. All right. Sean, Larry wants to know if you opened the box he's got for you. No, I have not, Larry. Would you like me to open it? I know it has food in it. Open the box. Larry says so. Oh, I never watched Zootopia. No? Uh-uh. Lisa is trolling Amazon... <laughs> I am glad to have turned some people on. I am an Amazon whore. Ooh, Elizabeth said she entered to win a signed Elvira for you, Brittany. Thank you, Elizabeth. I hope you win. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> Larry, I, I don't know where they are. I don't even know where they could be. Like, I, I went through today and I looked in my closet in the office closet, I looked in my bathroom closet, in the hallway closets. Why Why were you checking closets? Maybe it's just on a table or something. I don't just have tables that don't have stuff on them, okay? <laughs> <laughs> That's not how it works over here. 
Uh, no, well, they had Kazi. Uh, Larry, are you sure we didn't like put it in Andrew's car, or put it back in your car, so that Kazi wouldn't eat it? It's not on the bar. It's not in the kitchen. I looked in the kitchen closet. I looked in. I looked where the. Sorry, closet. Justin. Why? Why are you just like Amazon shoppers? Because they're having to deliver a crap ton of stuff, probably. Did Kazi eat it? I'm pretty sure Kazi did not eat an entire box. <laughs> Much less two boxes. That doesn't make any sense. It would have been there would have been evidence. He said no, you grabbed them before we went to lunch. I I grabbed them and did what? <laughs> I don't know. I mean, if they're sealed boxes, I can't imagine what I did with them. Uh, Grumpy, that's just a, a regional thing. Amazon doesn't deliver here. Yeah, nope. you gotta you gotta have their little outlets or whatever near you. No, Jeremy, I get all of Ira pops. Nice. We have not had Hooters wings in God knows how Ooh. long because they closed the Hooters in town. Whoa, have, who's got Hooters wings? Anthony. Which Anthony? Forever Freaky Funko. Yeah. Anthony, your wife lets you go to Hooters? I go to Hooters with Brian. I he said that. he's at Hooters eating dinner with Sophie. Yeah. I love it with Sophie. No. Sophia. That's why I said Sophia. Oh, it sounded like he said Sophie. That's what I said. Oh. That's what I thought Brian said. <laughs> you opening Larry's box? I am. Sweet. Larry, are you sure you didn't put the other boxes inside this box? <laughs> the food is great. It's not a strip club. <laughs> Anthony, I like to get their curly fries and dip them in ranch dressing. I can't see yeah. anything, Larry. No, the nacho cheese. Larry, or this box food. is peak yeah. proof. Oh, I had nachos from California Tortilla. Don't do that. Don't do that to yourself. Well, I don't know what California tortilla is, so. And it, it'll make you poop your pants. Oh, okay. Pop couple or Lisa sending me more stuff. Ooh, ooh, that one's got Beetlejuice and Shaun of the Dead. Ooh, you know what? I have that. Um, I have that Alfred Hitchcock, and I had the Glow in the Dark Cthulhu. But my but Zoe ate Cthulhu. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Sean Ryan and Kazi and Serene. Larry, is this your handwriting? If so, I understand why you only ate a salad. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> <laughs> and there's a little smiley dude right there. Uh, I, I nice, think, Anthony. I think he's trying to call you a woman. <laughs> no offense, ladies. A holiday poem when Christmas gets stressful and tense as can be. Remember the angel on top of your tree who keeps smiling joyfully no matter what. Hashtag Larry. Nice. Just think how you'd feel with a tree up your butt. Cosmo, seriously? Like you just freaking walk. Go, get under there. Go, 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 go. <laughs> it's like a tower of pops and he's just like thunk. Walks right into it. <laughs> Don't care at all. Here, let me headbutt these. Yeah. Basically, yeah, buddy. There's no. I don't think there's any food in this box. He thinks every box has food. <laughs> Sorry, just think how you feel with the tree up your butt. But try not to think about it and enjoy your holidays. P.S. Thanks for having me over. Uh, you're welcome. You wrote that before, so that uh, hashtag Aiden signed it. Take care. Much love. Hashtag family. Larry, Kayla, and hashtag Aiden. Nice. And Larry also wrote. A book over here. Sean, Merry Christmas. Hope you like this small gift. I also hope Kazi and Serene like their gifts too. We'll find them one day, Larry. <laughs> Thanks for being an awesome friend. I hope you have a wonderful Christmas and a happy new year. Kazi and Serene, you all are awesome too. You hear that, buddy? You're awesome. Just stop knocking the pops over. Just, just stop being an asshole for like 10 minutes, Kazi. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right. Larry, this is what I'm talking about. That's how you start a box. Flaming hot funions. Yeah, buddy. There you go. 
big old thing of Funyuns. I used Funyuns to pack one of James's things, and uh, <laughs> then he was like, "I don't like Funyuns." <laughs> he doesn't like onions. He doesn't like a whole lot of stuff. <laughs> he and Larry should go to lunch. <laughs> Lisa ate him though. Kiss. <laughs> it's like in the box. Yeah, at All least right. said she ate him. To Sean. Ooh. 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 Oh, yeah. Ooh. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> yeah, boy. <laughs> Ooh, I saw chocolate mint Twinkies today at Walmart. Larry, you wrap the stuff? <laughs> <laughs> no kidding. This is the, the least wrapped thing in here. So this is John from hashtag Larry. It's Larry, not- Larry absolutely loves Christmas. So his tree yeah. has been up since Easter <laughs> of 2014. Yeah. <laughs> it's never been down. <laughs> what is? Oh, oh, okay. So you told me about this one. Larry came across a double X in the icy Viserion shirt. Nice. nice. It says winter is here. So I'm not going to bust that out because. I have a uh, white fur beast right next to me <laughs> and it will just instantly be all hairy. What else we got? There's a lot of stuff in here. So there's this, I don't know what this is. I don't know what any of this is. There's this, there's a sorter with hashtag Larry sticker. There's something that's wrapped. That's about the size of a sorter. And there's something that's wrapped. That's a little smaller than a sorter. This is exciting, and I'm not even opening it. <laughs> is it really, or is it my boring you guys? No, no, I like watching people open presents. While while he's doing that, we're going to get into our first Australian snack, twisties, cheese twisters. Which I'm pretty sure we've gotten these. Yeah, we got those from Kiwi Couple. Yeah, yeah. And then I bought them again because twisties are delicious. So this one says it's not in great shape, but cool out of the box or however you want to display. From hashtag Larry. Oh, all right. Well, this is. Oh, that's right. You did tell me this too, Larry. Uh, I don't care really about the box so much. Well, oh, that's cool. yeah, it's the Viserion that comes with the T-shirt. So very cool. Thank you, Larry. Uh, oh, that's cool, Sarah. Dude, these are better than Cheetos. They're good, aren't they? Yep. Right. Larry, they're all from you, man. They they're nicely wrapped. They have little glittery stickers that say "To Sean from hashtag Larry." <laughs> I didn't wrap anything. Like I put it on the table and was like, "There you go, guys. That's your pile, Andrew. It's your pile, Larry." And then I bought them some uh, like hot sauces and just stuff that's uh, from around here. That's cool. Hashtag Larry said the small thing was made for you by a friend of his. Asked her to make it for you. Her card's in it, too. Okay. Sweet. This one's a pop. I can tell because it's in a pop shield. It is a... Ooh! Sam. I got a Sam from Supernatural. I'm not showing these really well. I love Supernatural. And I don't have any Sam pops. Which I believe Larry asked me. That's really good. Holy crap, that's good. Sorry, the energy drink is amazing. What's it taste like? I don't. A uh, heaven. <laughs> heaven. <laughs> Angel tea. Thirty-five grams of sugar in it. That's where you get the energy. <laughs> I'm already bouncing. So yeah, this is the energy drink. Somebody said don't drink that. I don't know why. Uh, oh, too late. So this is the one you said is from made by one of your friends, Larry. Again, still wrapped. Cosmo still thinks it's food. <laughs> and it's and bull semen. Delicious. This is the ingredients for Red Bull. Mm. All right, so apparently her name is Melody Blistra, Blistra, Dutch girl in New Mexico crafts. 
So there is Larry's friend's card. Cool. And what she made me is a little uh, hand-stitched Happy Taco guy. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> I'm getting a little collection of tacos now. Somebody sent me this this hangy tuxedo taco. I've got hand-stitched taco. And then there's... And Cosmo wants to eat all these, too. Then there's Taco Cat from Exploding Kids. Yes, Kiwi, I like V. <laughs> she loves the V and the D. <laughs> all right, Larry, I got two left. Which one should I do next? Should I do this thing? It's Larry, is this the Porg? I think... <laughs> Come back, Lisa. <laughs> I saw that at Target. <laughs> Sean no longer has to make porg noises. We have a new channel mascot. <laughs> it does not taste like cat piss. <laughs> Kazi, that's not your porg. That's daddy porg. I mean, I don't know what cat piss tastes like. That's daddy porg. Thank you, Anthony. Thank, thank you, Anthony. He says, smash that, smash that like button. <laughs> Cosmo is already obsessed with porg. <laughs> Awesome, Larry. Uh, I don't mean to play favorites, but, you know, poor. You have one more, don't you? I got one more. It's wrapped. Feels like a sorter box. It says, to the taco man. From hashtag L. I'm going to assume that's Larry. Probably. It is, in fact, a sorter box that says Mickey unhooded from Kingdom Hearts. Organization 13. Mickey. <laughs> Grumpy says cat piss is a delicacy in the southern U.S. <laughs> Thank you, Larry. I do not, I don't think I have this one. I think you asked me about him too, but this is the uh, the one-handed Luke. Nice. From 2016 cool. convention. Yes. So, Larry, awesome job, man. Thank you so much for all the Christmas gifts, buddy. I gotta say, very well done. <laughs> Love the Sam, love the Viserion, love the Luke. Of course, I love my taco and my pork. <laughs> <laughs> I, I remember fact. that episode. I tried that several times after that episode. Never got <laughs> oh, <gosh>. where, where <laughs> they were <laughs> making the cat spray you in the face. Oh goodness! It's got to be a male cat. <laughs> No cat. <laughs> What's up, you OJ? Jay, where's my Naruto? Yo, Jay. Oh. No. <laughs> no, Matthew. We opened a chalice box. Sean opened a toy USA box. Joe, I hit the wrong button. My bad, bro. <laughs> this is the greatest thing ever. <laughs> oh, Devin, time Joji out. <laughs> Devin was just looking for a reason to time out, Joe. <laughs> it sounds sick. It's not terrifying as Porg. <laughs> I'm surprised the child isn't talking yet. <laughs> He's just a baby. <laughs> that should be my intro. He's 50 years old. Yeah. <laughs> Which Yoda was over 900, so. And he died. <laughs> What's his name? Trocare lived to be like several thousand years old. Spoiler alert. I don't think Larry's gotten that far. Yeah, he did. <laughs> oh, okay. 
It sounds like an elephant. No, it's a bird. Kind of. Bird with no beak. <laughs> the poor guy set is in your horror collection, Larry. These say atomic tomato. Atomic tomato. I want to try those. Sam boy. I have indigestion. Let's eat some spicy tomato snacks. That That's what had. I'm talking about. <laughs> oh, God. You opened it like me. <laughs> that bag just freaking ripped open. All right, let me catch up on snacks. What did you guys eat? Uh, just the twisties and now the Samboy. Guys, you want to try the Samboys? Let me let the daddy taste first. Anthony said forever freaky funk. I mean, Anthony said forever freaky funko. That doesn't make any sense. He said baby Yoda should fight a porg. <laughs> Is it just me, or are these, like, not spicy at all? No. -uh. I think maybe they just mean atomic, as in, like, a lot of tomato flavor. You like that, Kazi? Because these taste like they've been dipped in, like, tomato soup almost. Yeah. They have, like, a really soft, like, salt and vinegar flavor almost. They're yeah. Very, they, got, they definitely have the acidic flavor of the tomato. Which means Brittany will eat no more of these. Yep. Dipped in cat piss, Fritzy Funko. Yep. <laughs> if you guys haven't had twisties, though, get yourself oh, some chips. Even, even if they have. Hey. Oh, you got water? No. Even the, the chicken ones are really good. Are they? Oh, yeah. What are you guys going after next? Oh. Vegemite and cheese? Which one is that? That's these shapes. The black bagged ones? Yeah. I Okay. Grippos are the best chips. I've never tried Grippos. If you guys got a favorite and you can get like a small bag or something super cheap, let me know because I'll try them. Right. So far, my favorite thing is, has been the burger rings with the... Uh, uh, what were the things we were eating with those? The uh, I don't remember what we were putting with the burger rings that was making it taste like a delicious shit. cheeseburger. It was the damn uh, I can't remember. Oh, what? Yeah. Uh. It's kind of a weird rations. That's what it was. Yeah. Yes, the rations, the bacon and cheese rations. That's right. Yes. All right. So these are oven baked shapes. Apparently flavor we can see. Vegemite <laughs> and cheese. Does Bernie come back? Yeah. She went to go grab some water real quick. Oh, let's get Bernie. A second. I didn't realize. Yeah. This, was, uh... what? this is Vegemite and cheese. I don't like Vegemite. Oh, did yours come with stickers? Yes. I got stickers. Oh, well, that's not bad. Oh, Brittany already ate it. Damn. Girl, <laughs> we were waiting for you and you just like bust in. <laughs> it's pretty good. I like that. Not bad. I'd eat that. Kind of tastes like combos. Yeah. Yeah. Kind of that's tastes like those, you know, those chicken and biscuit. Um, yes, that's a, good, that's a good comparison. Yep, mm -hmm. chicken and a biscuit. Yep, dude, those and some freaking spray cheese. <laughs> oh man, this is how we all got fat, people. Um, then you figure out you just eat the spray cheese or put it on bacon. Oh, yeah, yeah. Or your finger. <laughs> you th Matthew, you think we need uh, My Cousin Vinny Pops? They'd be kind of plain, though. They would. I mean, you could get, like, the... the I mean, you can get the Ralph Macchio character by just buying, you know, Daniel's son. Boom. Double the effort. <laughs> Let's see. You want to try the pizza flavored ones next? Uh, Larry, I love hot chocolate. I make Brian make it for me at night. 
What am I looking at your thumbnail for, Jay? It's you with a box on your head. That's the one you're talking about? Why am I... Jay, somehow I'm unsubscribed to you. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Better if I say it and try and sneak it back in. And then it says, Sean Ryan has subscribed to your channel. <laughs> Devin does that to me on Instagram, I think, to screw with me. I actually like these Vegemite things. I do, too. Uh, I, I got to show this comment because it's hilarious. So, hang on. If Brian can find it. <laughs> Nemesis number one's Winnie the Pooh. Yeah. Yep. Look here, number two. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Devin deleted it and timed him out. <laughs> All right, pizza one's next. Oh, are you doing the pizza? Um, I bet you these taste like pizza combos. Yeah. Oh, they, they smell like them, dude. Straight Ooh. up smell like them. Did you ever try the pizza <laughs> flavored? Do you guys remember Oboy Oboises? The Keebler potato chips that had like the bubbles in them because they were like fried or baked or whatever. I remember O'Doyle rules. Oh, these taste like the pizza Oboises. These don't have much flavor to them. Yes, they do. No. I'm not getting a whole bunch either, but I, I think I was expecting something different. Eat that one. No, I just ate one that had something like that. I was looking for that punch. No, it's, got that, it's like that the atomic tomato chips. It's got a lot of that tomato y type seasoning in it. Yeah. Oh, boisterous. Yes. What what do you want to go to next, Sean? Um, hold on. I want to look up these chips first. What are they? Okay. What oh, are they boises? Is that what you're looking up? Yeah, how do you spell that? O B E S I E S. I Start think? typing it out. Hold on, let me see. Uh it it auto completes to obesity. Oh boy Z. There's gotta were, be like a Y or something in there. They were Keebler. Okay, there was an apostrophe. O apostrophe. Oh! Those you know what those are? Those are oh boys. No, those are the TGI Fridays uh Potato skins. No, they're not. I remember those. Those. That's what they are now. That's Wait, so, people someone tell me how how to spell this. O oh. apostrophe b o i s i e s. Oh, like Boise. The first four letters I got from Brittany were O B E S. Yo, yeah, no, I know. Brittany doesn't smell good. <laughs> <laughs> I said spell. <laughs> No, it's, you said smell. <laughs> it sounded like I said smell. <laughs> oh, boy. You know you said smell. That's why you... <laughs> no, no, no. This is what I said. It just sounded that way coming out of my mouth because that's what I really said. <laughs> Sorry, my nose is stuffed up. Elizabeth what, said you said smell. <laughs> what, were those, what were those other chips that were like little... They were always potato. I think they were like potato and cheese. Frick. They kind of look like this. They're little oval-shaped chips. Well, Oboises were oval-shaped. Yeah, I'm look. I'm looking at the Oboises. I, <laughs> I have it up on my screen. Now. Are you talking about the potato skins? Is that what they're actually called? Is potato skins? Yeah. The TGI Friday. The TGI potato Friday potato skins. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. Yeah, those. I will destroy a bag of those damn things. Uh, what do we got here? We got watermelon chews. We got. Ooh, what are those? Oh, I bet these are good. Strawberries and cream Allens. Do you have these, Sean? The pods? Um. Oh, look out, Cos. We lost a card. We lost the hashtag. Like a, a cookie base with a Mars bar on top. No, I don't have pods. Oh. Do you sorry. guys have Whiz Fizz? Yes, we have Whiz We Fizz. have the Whiz Fizz. Do you have the Allen Strawberry and Creams? Wait, so how come I don't have the other thing? Because we pay $50 a box. He has Holy donkey nuggets, really? You're not doing the yeah. premium box, are you? Heck no. Yeah, we do the premium box. Yeah, I, I don't need the premium box. I got this. 
So let me tell you a story, Sean. This is why Brian's not allowed to spend money without Brittany's approval. Because I found out after the fact that this was costing us $50 a month and we can't cancel it because we're in a contract. <laughs> oh, yeah. You get like six month contracts with them. Yeah. Well, you guys try whatever. What well, the heck? This looks like a pile of turds that'll make you take a pile of turds. The pods are good, Kiwi Couple. Sean, these pods are delicious. Well, I don't have pods. I have Milo, Milo. the source of a fiber. source of fiber. <laughs> Looks it like says a turd. That? Actually, it says a source of fibre. <laughs> I don't know if I want to eat that then. It's this, not. This is your poo-poo bar. <laughs> yeah. You gotta take a dump, eat this bar. They sent us a fiber one from Australia. <laughs> oh, I will eat some fiber ones. You better believe it. My roommate used to eat, well, our old roommate used to eat fiber ones all the time and then be like, I can't stop farting. And we're like, no shit. Yeah, <laughs> stop eating them. No, lots of shit. <laughs> Kazi, you want twist? That's a good boy. There's some good looking candy in here. Okay, Harry, Harry, hashtag Larry, who is now known as Harry. Um, said that you were putting Kazi's box up because it's full of treats. It is on top of your fridge or something. Top of my fridge. Oh, the the Zappo watermelon chews. Is that what you were? Uh... I've got that. Let me see if Larry's right. All right. So, chili and sour cream. We have had these before, right? No. No. They're kettle cooked. Well, you might have if Kiwi sent them, but you ate a lot of things without me that first time. Those are good. Those are good. Oh, those are good. Those are really good. He did eat the flamingo cookie. Nothing wrong with Milo. I don't know. It's a fiber bar. <laughs> You're welcome, Lisa. Didn't you just eat turkey soup? I'm saving these for like the very last thing that we eat. Because yeah. I love them. Why don't you wait for Sean to get back? All right, Larry, just for you, buddy, I looked on top of the fridge in all the cupboards <coughs> above the washing machine and dryer. I got nothing. I don't know where it is. Ah, Hopefully it's not perishable. Here you go, Kyle. Those are really good. Which ones? The pods. I'm sorry you're missing out on them. I don't know how many pods. <laughs> sorry. Those are really Christy. good. They are delicious. He's getting this piece. Sorry, guys. I don't have pods, but I do have porg. Porg! Wow, JJ. That's awesome. What? I'm guessing that's what he got in his um, big box. Uh, does it have to do with Game of Thrones? Yes. That is it. Yep. What, what big box? So when Sean said that he knew what JJ got in his box. 500. Oh. I got you. All right, what are we trying next? We're we're oh, don't worry, Tia. We're gonna get to the French fries. French fries. We have, we have a very uh, a very good feeling that those are gonna be delicious. You guys have French fries? I don't. I don't have. Oh, the little matchstick things. Yeah. yeah. You don't have a. Mm mm. I have a bunch of candy. Do you have the sweet chili and sour cream chips? Nope. No, but he does have the watermelon chews. Let's do those then. I've got cherry flavored cheese, apparently. Cherry flavored cheese. Oh, it says cherry ripe. I thought it said cherry brie. <laughs> That'd be weird for them to send brie in a box <laughs> from Australia. <laughs> I don't know. I think this is bubble gum in here, too. I don't know. I'm trying the watermelon chew. Who creates packaging where you can't tell what it is? It's just like a thousand words on here. Yeah. 
You there's a the watermelon thingy? Yeah. Oh, there's sour watermelon. Mm-hmm. Mm. Didn't wasn't there word that uh Funko did get the, the rights to the McDonald's stuff? They already have the rights because if they have wacky wobblers of Grimace and Hamburglar and all those people. I like these. Yeah. These are good. Mm hmm. Mm. Mm. It does say sour flavor cheese. Yeah. Mm. They're very good. Let's just stop chew for a minute. Very loudly. Hold on. <laughs> ASMR cheap and nerdy streams. <laughs> Sean, would you say that uh, this chew makes your your mouth very moist? I would say that. I would say everything about this stream makes me very moist. <laughs> Does it make you feel the need to slurp? <clears throat> I'm going to go with no. I'm going to go back to the twisties also. <laughs> yes, pickles. Brittany, say those three words. Moist. Supple. Cusp. Now say Alice. Alice. Is. Is. Pickles. Tickles. I always thought it was Elise. No, it's Alice. <laughs> she prefers to be called Alice Stubbles. <laughs> I'm sure. <laughs> Who's that Tickles? <laughs> No, Brittany said it right. <laughs> Alice. I don't know what these are, but my God, they look delicious. They're iced Vovo. Whatever whatever iced Vovo is. You want some, either. You want some like a, Vovo? That looks like a Pop-Tart. It looks like a Pop-Tart. <laughs> <laughs> no Sean, pickles. Your boyfriend told me you suck. Uh -huh. We do have a cherry right too. Kazi and I both vote for Twisties being the best thing in this box. You haven't eaten everything yet. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Oh, Sean, try the Violet Crumble. Ooh. Ooh those are delicious. So this is what they look like. Very fuzzy. Yeah. Very fuzzy. Yummy, yummy. Is it like a cracker or a cookie? A cookie. Mmm. Ice Bobo. I'm in love with the Vovo. No, Kazi, <laughs> Kazi literally just wants Twisty. <laughs> He's good. Oh my God. I love Vovo. These are delicious. This, this is a very different video watching <laughs> us eat the food versus Pop Couple. The Pop Couple's all like scared of the food. Everything we eat, we're like, fucking amazing. <laughs> we're we're, we're the so fat are just like, nah. <laughs> all right, Violet Crumble. Dude, that candy bar is about to be life changing. I don't know if he'll like it. You gotta let it like dissolve and it's a crumbly honeycomb toffee center coated in two layers of creamy chocolate. I don't know if that's for me. Really? Yeah. That was all right, but it it tastes like that hard confectionery sugar treats you make in the middle. You mean the meringue? Yeah, those kind of things. Kind of. I love the flavor. Like the honeycomb flavor. Yeah. It's not bad, but there's better like honey type things that I like. 
I love those Vovos, yo. Brown's speaking covered of, last week, Joe. Speaking of pop couple and tasting stuff, you know the things they call the toilet bowl sticks? I can get like a pack of 50 of them, different flavors on Amazon for like 11 bucks. Who votes that we send 50 different flavors to them? Anybody? <laughs> <laughs> I do. <laughs> Uh, I do, I do. <laughs> Who wants a mustache ride? <laughs> I, I do. Grab your smartphone, find a moment to fizz, and monstergram it. What are we supposed to do with the fizz? Pop couple said no. <laughs> she I said, don't. order them and eat them. <laughs> I don't. What are we, Kiwi couple? Are you still here? What are we supposed to do with this? I think it's like that thing with the, the candy stick. You just dip it and lick it, except we don't have a candy stick. No, we probably put it in water. No, you probably dip your finger in it. I think it's a... Sh Wait a minute. Hold on. It says, why is it telling us how much energy is in this? The Brits do this. Do oh, that instead of calories? Yeah. That they do that with. This is Australia, not New Zealand. So why are you asking Kiwi Kibble? Because they're next to each other. They may know. I mean, yeah, they might ask us what Canadians and Mexicans do. Lick the stick, then dip. There's no stick. There's no stick. Oh, there is a stick in there. there oh, is. no. I, yeah, okay. I feel it. I, I mean, didn't feel it at first. Yeah, it's, I like it's, the two men saying they feel the stick. I feel the stick. <laughs> it's not real big, but I can feel it. That's okay, Sean. <laughs> What is like those candies? So it's like a fun dip, kind yeah. of. It's like, got a little shovel. Oh my this god. Is... <laughs> you guys make fun of us for spoons? Look at this. It's a goddamn shovel for sugar. <laughs> <laughs> you just put that whole thing in your mouth. Is it whizzy fizzy? I mean, a little bit. Original strawberry. It's a cocaine spoon. <laughs> Thanks, LJ. <laughs> yeah, it, it's nothing like Pop Rocks or anything like that. It does have a little bit of the <laughs> carbonation factor. The amount of you guys that were just like, sort it, or snort it, rather. <laughs> Could you imagine snorting this? It'd be like snorting a pixie stick. Oh, oh, that was a bad idea back in school. Brittany, you're getting it. Why do I allow you to play with anything that is powder related? How often do I play with powder? Your makeup. <laughs> don't do it, Sean. Your makeup, powdered sugar. That's why I don't wear makeup, you guys. Brian doesn't allow me. If my nose wasn't stuffed up, I'd totally do it. <laughs> Maybe that'll clear it. I doubt it. M mine's pretty, uh, pretty bad, too. Pretty big? Bad. Oh. Mm. I like the flavor. <coughs> I think it's part drugs. Kiwi couple did say kids here snort it. <laughs> sure they do. Your post-nasal drip is delicious. <laughs> <laughs> what? If you snort it, that shit's just going to go down the back of your throat. I don't like your booger fantasies. <laughs> yes. I fantasize about boogers. Quadruple dare me to snort it? My nose is stuffed up. It's never going to go up there. Kiwi couples that sprinkle it on your dog biscuits, Sean. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, the pink flamingo thing didn't taste that bad. <laughs> I was just very confused. It looked like a cookie. <laughs> I asked Quick Draw, I'm like, dude, what is this thing? He's like, ah, it's from some fancy dog store. Devin, we're not going to do it, so pay the 10 to Sean. <laughs> Wait a minute. Oh, oh thank God. you, Matthew. Seagulling. <laughs> LJ said so is the cocaine drip. <laughs> <laughs> what is seagulling? I'm sure you don't want to know. 
Is it, is it where you sit on a rock and go, mine, mine, mine? <laughs> That was that was interesting. See going. I'm looking it up. No. Mm. Well, I'm just trying to. So Violet Crumble, not necessarily for me. That was the same thing as the other ones. Some people say it's different. I think it's the same. They taste the same to me. What? The um which calls? Crunchies and Violet Crumbles. I'm uh, we both, Umpty, Brittany, and I both were Navy kids. Why do Australians try? Like, why is everybody always trying to sneak coconut in everything? <laughs> <laughs> Read the third definition of seagull. In. <laughs> How am I supposed to read it? It's when you put something special, your special seed, in your hand. <laughs> And you slap somebody with it. And with. No, it just says. Yeah, you just slap them with your salty hand. <laughs> and for some reason, that's seagull. And I'm, I'm trying these. The uh, strawberries and cream jelly thingies. Brian already had them open. Mm -hmm. Are these the ones that have the stuff in the middle? Mm -hmm. Oh. Ooh. They're gummies, Lisa. These remind me of um damn it. The pull apart twizzlers. Hmm. Yeah, the red and white swirled ones. Yeah. I can see that, yeah. <laughs> Lisa said jealous. Yeah. There's not a whole lot going on with these. I wish I had more strawberry flavor. Mm-hmm. It sounds like a game of soggy biscuit. <laughs> I'm sure there's another name for it. Who said that? Here we go, boom. Oh. These are good. A friend of mine at work said she was in the bar with her ex-boyfriend's grandmother when they were still together. And the grandmother was talking about the dearly departed grandfather and how he liked a good rusty trombone. <laughs> she spit her... Her, her drink everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> what do you guys have that you haven't tried? A lot. Well, we haven't tried a rusty trombone. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> we haven't tried whatever this is. I don't, I don't know that you're going to try that on stream. I'm, we ain't going to try it, period. Well, so let's see what this is. It's chocolate? Fantails. Oh, I saw somebody say they're chocolate covered something. I still have strawberry gummy in my mouth. It's chewy. Caramel. Ooh, caramel. Does it caramel taste like taffy? It's really thick. Good lord. It's a bonbon. Bon. Chewy caramel and chocolate. Mm -hmm. Ooh, piece candy. That's Ooh. all right. They're stuck in my teeth. That's not bad. I just gleaked everywhere. It reminds me of an... Uh... You just what? <laughs> <laughs> gleaked. Hey, Alexandra. Gleaked? Yeah. That's not a word. <laughs> really? Who here knows what gleaked is? I'm assuming it's when you spit from chewing. It's when the little thing, you know, that little spit gland on your tongue, like, sh just shoots out. <laughs> your saliva gland. Yeah, your saliva gland. When you're doing something, it's just like, <laughs> To discharge a long, thin stream of liquid through the teeth or from under the tongue. Uh-huh. From <laughs> under. <laughs> I read it like that on purpose. <laughs> sure you did. And Brian said smell. I mean, smell. Fell. <laughs> From under cheese. <laughs> the man said he gleeked on the woman. But not intentionally. <laughs> In Australia, they are also called filler breakers. I can see that. Yeah. I've, I've never heard. So that's two things in the last couple of days I've never heard of. Never heard of gleeked. I never heard of stuffing called dressing. Really? Yeah. I've I my mom called the dressing. I'm like. 
known you for my whole life and you've never said that before. I don't call it dressing. I call it stuffing, but that's because we're Navy brats. But down here where we live, it's, it's dressing. dressing. Somebody was saying it's dressing if you don't cook it in the turkey. That's, that's what some people say. Some people say if it's in the turkey, it's stuffing. If it's out of the turkey, it's dressing. If you're in the South, it doesn't matter if you shoved it up somebody's butt. It's dressing. Um, interesting. Yo, J says Gleek is the same thing as cackle or cackling. Cackle is laughing. That's what Brittany does when she's on stream with Lisa. <laughs> I'm going to try the cherry ripe. Okay. Chocolate covered cherry. And coconut. Oh, and coconut? Yeah. Otherwise, I would have been eating it already. And it's dark chocolate. You don't like coconut? Not a huge fan, but I'll eat it. This looks like a lot of coconut. This is a cherry flavored mound bar. I yep. love mounds. Who came up with this garbage? <laughs> uh, who thought that tasted good? I think it tastes good. Ugh. Make I like up. mounds bars too, though. Oh, I've heard the Kiwis know how to freaking make uh, some whiskey down there, by the way. That tastes like cough syrup covered in chocolate and fermented in someone's asshole. <laughs> <laughs> it, does, it does not to me. And yes, all soft drinks are Coke. And that person definitely ate a lot of nuts recently. <laughs> Cocoa nuts. <laughs> yeah, it's all stuck to my teeth. Okay, see, I don't like Almond Joys, and it's not because I don't like almonds. I don't like the coconut with the milk chocolate. I prefer the coconut with the dark chocolate. Yeah. They say sometimes you feel like a nut, sometimes you don't, but that's not the only difference between a Mounds and an Almond Joy. Did you get any Tim Tams? I did. I'm going to try that, and then I'm going to try the poo-poo bar. It looks like a chocolate Rice Krispie treat, let's be honest. Kind of. I need more water. Jeez. Tim Tam. What's in a Tim Tam? It's a cookie. It's a cookie covered in chocolate. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. No. That's good. Do you want any more Tim Tim? You can have it. No. Mm -hmm. I right. know why Brian's fat. I approve of Tim Tim. And you said you're going to do the fart bar next? Yeah, Tim Tam also has like a cream in the middle of it too. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Boo boo bar. Okay, poo poo bar. Excellent source of fiber. Oh, this looks like the Cocoa Pebbles Rice Krispie treats I made. That's what I was saying. Does it taste like that? No, it does not. It tastes like cardboard. <laughs> <laughs> made from recycled YouTube unboxers. No. Smell it. I mean, if I was looking for fiber, I might go that way. Yeah, if you'd like to poop your pants, that's probably good. <laughs> Haggis is illegal in the USA. I don't. I don't think so. What? Who said that? Umpty scratch. They're, they're not wrong. Actually, it's because it of what it's made so? it. Good night, Yoj. <laughs> Brittany didn't smell it. She just put it in her mouth. It's a very non-sugary chocolate Rice Krispie treat. Yeah. It's got a good chocolate flavor to it, at least. Yeah. It, it tastes like cocoa, but mm -hmm. there's not a whole lot of sugar in it. And there's definitely no marshmallows in it. She just put it in her mouth. She said sing it, and you didn't sing it. There you go. Nothing can be. Yeah, it's very graphic and correct, Humpty. We'll get to that. Good lord, we still have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Good lord, thirteen things, and they're all sugar. I have golden rough. Yep. yep. Mint patty. 
Yep. Yep. And chomp. Yeah, that's what I got left. Um, we still have something called a Frito. It's a strawberry chocolate thing. A Carmelo Koala. A Caramello. Whatever. Wagon Wheel. Oh, that's like a moon pie. That looks good. Uh, a Choquito. Yeah, this is definitely some diabetes food. Girl. <laughs> Chewy caramel fudge, crunchy balls, and loads of chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> uh, nougat honey log. Log. A peppermint crisp. And a picnic dark chalk fest. Joe, hey. Michigan and the over. The french fries. We still have the Violet Crumble, which we will probably save. And we have a giant cookie. I didn't get a cookie. <laughs> uh, it's called a traditional Anzac. Whatever the hell that means. Let's so call it, call down, Devin. I'll tell you right now, I already know wagon wheels are exactly like moon pies, but they have jam in between with the marshmallow. Mm. Y'all like moon pies? Moon pies are big down here, too. Moon pies were started in, in Mobile. Yeah. Mobile. Mobile, Alabama. Mobile. Box cheap and nerdy. Snack crate. Snack crate. Wait, you can't bet on college football on this site, Devin? How am I supposed okay. to know? Uh -huh. <laughs> You're making a mess. I oh, college football is under NFL. Oh no, it's under football. I see. I see. Never mind. Shilling? No, we don't get no money for it. Dude, you gotta take Michigan in the over because Michigan is gonna win by twenty. We do have a link though. We have a link where it just gives us like a discount on our box, but it doesn't make us any money. Save it gives, some money. Then they give you 10 bucks if you do a referral. But it goes towards your box. You don't get like 10 bucks. Right. I want 10 bucks. Devin, so, that's the bet. So you're taking Michigan in the under, right? And the over. Oh, in the over. Yeah, Michigan's going to destroy them. I don't really drink that much, though. She doesn't. Mm -mm. I prefer not to, actually. Devin, calm down. My team already lost today. Yeah. I I'd actually, I need to look up to see if mine got their ass kicked. I'm, I'm sure they did. I need more water, all this sugar. I actually saw that they had come back and tied the game up, but I don't know what happened after that. Um, Are you trying to bet on Ohio State, Joe? Oh, shit. Nebraska only lost by three. Last second field goal, damn. They came back. They were down at half, 24 to 10. They came back and tied the game. <clears throat> sure, betting on Ohio State. Uh, I don't know about that. That game is in Michigan, right? Is it in Ann Arbor? I think so. All right. I think I'm done with chocolate right now. Yeah, I, I'm done with the chocolate. I retire from chocolate eating right now. Yeah. Especially that nasty cherry thing. You go ahead. No, I'm, I'm done. There's too much sugar right now. I'm going to go into the french yes, fries. Yes, we'll do the french fries. I'll have to live vicariously through the stream. <clears throat> it's just so fat. <laughs> Will you stop? 
They're just potato sticks. Brian seems to like them. Uh, um, there's a reason why I don't buy the big cans of them anymore. Uh, wait a minute. Much. Wait a minute. Don't use that. <laughs> don't, yeah, don't use, <laughs> don't use those. Uh, but, yeah. Brian used to also buy the big things of cheese balls. Joe, I can bet online. I don't need to bet you. Me and Kim used to kill the big oots. Oots. Uh, oots. 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 Cheese balls. Barrels. Oh, yeah. Those are dangerous. Casey's fat, too. <laughs> Uh, with the points, Joe, or just the straight bet? Oh, it's crab chips. I've had those. I like the uh, it's um waffle pretzels, the buttery waffle pretzels. They're like little silver, not silver, circular <laughs> waffle. Oh, I can eat those. I don't think I've tried those. They're really good. But you have to like buttery pretzels because, like, <laughs> some people don't like the butter flavored pretzels. Now do it with two hands, Sean. <laughs> with two cans? With two hands. <laughs> I don't have to need two cans. <laughs> Brian. <laughs> that got screenshot. <laughs> Whatever. If it didn't, they could just go back and pause the stream and get it. Right? Dude, that's, that still like brings me back to. Um, Sexy Pants's uh, makeup video, Captain Sexy Pants's, when he was doing the makeup tutorial, and he, he was putting like this this crazy amount of makeup on. And then he was talking about shaking the foundation, and he's like, ah, "I just shake it." Ah. <laughs> That's like the funniest video ever. There's chat. There's pop couple forty dollar mystery boxes. I did not know that, Larry. You guys are talking about Christmas. Christmas is not an acceptable holiday to speak of until after the 19th of December. No, you speak of it as soon as Thanksgiving's over. No, after the 19th of December. Why are you so salty? Oh, yeah. you got it in a raffle. Okay. I didn't know there was Pop Couple Mystery. Yeah, Larry got a Red Hulk from my duplicate box. I'm not a Grinch. We just have to make it past my birthday, Devin. I already gave you your birthday present like two months ago. Yeah, I know. I just gave him his last night. That sounds dirty. <laughs> Are you going to tell us what it was? I just rusty trombone him last night. <laughs> no. no, he got his Mario Odyssey and a wireless controller for the Wii. A wireless pro controller. Not for the Wii, the Switch. <laughs> Dirty seagull. I don't know, Sin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she pegged him. Oh, I went back and I was reading some of those other ones that Robert told us about <laughs> to my coworkers, and I was reading the Jolly Roger again, and that <laughs> made me laugh so hard because I forgot about the part where you kick her in the shin, so she starts jumping around like she's got a peg leg. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> we do not have Mario Kart. I do. Not for the Switch, no. I, Yeah, I want it, but... I got Mario Kart, Mario Odyssey, and Zelda. I want Link's Awakening. So bad. Don't have that. That's the newest one. But it's... it. Nobody had it on sale for Black Friday. Bernie, just buy it. No, it's $60. Okay, so buy it. Buy it. Sell it for 30. <laughs> I 
Or you can be like me and just never get rid of a video game ever. I don't. I don't get... Hold on. You hold on. What are you doing? I only bought a Switch because my company reimbursed me for buying it. That's nice. I bought a Switch because I wanted to play games. Well, I mean, I wanted it, but... I, I have her for a wife, so there was no buying it unless there was money coming back to pay for it. Which reminds me, the controller in the game that was for my birthday is going to be reimbursed by my company. So, What in the hell are you doing? <laughs> my old school Nintendo still. Mine's right there. With my games, yeah. <laughs> oh, I've I've got turbo controllers. Uh, no, nope, I just got the old school ones. This my grandparents got this for me for Christmas back in like eighty six or something. Devin, uh, whatever. My company has something called lifestyle rewards. So basically, up to three hundred and twenty five dollars a year, they'll pay for video game systems, airline tickets. Oh, yeah, so that's not your birthday present then, because we're getting the money back. Oh, I'm shysty, ain't I? <laughs> I just said that while you were in that room. So, uh, um, well, then don't you get most of your airline tickets paid for for ECCC? For, yeah, but we're not, we're going to book our tickets together and it has to be within the calendar year. So I have to wait until next year. So one of our tickets is pretty much going to be paid for. I don't have a capture card, JJ. So I'd either be doing it on an emulator. Or the super ghetto way by pointing a camera at a television. I have, I have my capture card, but I'm waiting until I get my uh, my new PC. Did you forget you have all these? We have a room full of forgetfulness. Chipotle hot sauce. There's Chipotle, cayenne, habanero, habanero. I thought they were beers. Mango habanero. Uh, summer spice hot sauce. Hello, mango God. habanero, jalapeno hot sauce, and American Valley garlic hot sauce. Devin, I mean, that's something. What do you say? <laughs> He's got a PS4 sitting in his car. He should give it away. We have a Nintendo 64 sitting in the other room. A Sega Genesis yep. original. <sighs> um, Super Nintendo... You, you want to give away a PS4, uh, Devin? You know my P.O. box address. If you don't, it's <laughs> in our videos. Um, yeah. <laughs> they didn't have Mario Kart on the original NES, though. It didn't come out till Super NES. We could bring our Switches and play Mario Kart. Yes, so Brian, Brian would have to get Mario Kart. Oh, I'll get Mario Kart. Don't worry about that. I will be play I will be playing video games on the plane ride over. On the Switch? Yeah, because this one will be sleeping. That's I don't what I, I, do. I don't sleep on planes, so I need something. Oh, you to do, do have a switch. Okay, cool. Pop couple, I was gonna tell you too, you should bring um like I would bring it, but we were having to pack a bag and, and go on a plane. But you said you got the Funko verse, you should bring it and we could play Funko Verse. I'm not playing Funko Verse, that looks dumb as hell. <laughs> I don't know how to play it. Sean's like lame. <laughs> play some Settlers of Catan. There you go. Let's play some D and D then. I'll give you all the D's. Wait a minute. You set up a ECCC storyline for D and D, okay? And you can be the. You can be the. You angered the beast. <laughs> Cosmo. Zelda Breath of the Wild, right? Because we can borrow that from his dad. Yeah. But I want the Link's Awakening. The GoFundMe is not going. <laughs> the, the GoFundMe is not going. <laughs> so we'll, we'll, we'll talk about this. Uh, if just if for you're going to mock it, Pop Couple, you don't get any of the fundies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, they, get, they get none of zero. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you get zero percent of zero. <laughs> <laughs> I... Fuck you, Devin. I want to play Breath of the Wild, but I keep telling Brian <laughs> to get it from his dad, and he keeps not getting it. I have it. 
Yeah. Because I want to play it. And so I say, hey, when you're over at your parents' house, grab Breath of the Wild. And he's like, I forgot. I'm like, ah! It's because I'm usually watching the Chiefs game when I'm over there. Uh, that's probably because they have no idea how to play it, JJ, because whoever made that game was not making Funkoverse for children. There's too many damn rules. Uh, my dad, so my dad has a PS4, Xbox One, Switch. Switch, and he plays them all. But he plays the games for a little while and then stops for a while and then picks them up and plays them again. And there comes a point where he forgets that he has them. Yeah. And I think we got to that phase finally. And that's Night Nicole. Good night, Nicole. Ryan swoops in and steals them. Uh-huh. Yep. Or I borrow dad's PS4 for six months. Until he's like, wait a minute, where's my PS4? And he comes and gets it. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, Dad, I'm going to borrow your PS4. I'll bring it back. And then he finally goes, hey, uh, you can bring back my PS4. <laughs> uh, Why, well, yeah, sure. Actually, no, that, that was the PS3. Remember the PS3? So I borrowed it. It was like, oh, it had to have been almost two years that I had it. Then he's like, hey, I want to get a PS4. I'm going to trade the PS3 and bring it up to GameStop. <laughs> what are you looking at? Are you playing Tariba? No, Kelly sent me a video. Ooh, what'd she win? Blood of Saiyan Goku, it looks like. Uh, the one with the metallic gold hair? Oh. oh, dang, that was like quick, too. Yeah, it was. Tell her we'll make her up a box. <laughs> metallic gold hair? Goku? No, no, red hair. Red hair. The one where he's like leaping forward? He's like this. I don't Hang know on. that one. Hang on. <coughs> Blood of the Saiyans. He's got like metallic looking red, reddish hair. Do I have Diablo 3 for PS4? I don't own a PS4, Larry. You were just here. He just gives them away. Hello, Adam and Tasha. What do I need a PS4 for? I mean... The only thing I might need it for is to play Final Fantasy VII when that comes out. And hopefully I win like all the money by then. Because I just need to like not work for a couple of weeks and play Final Fantasy. Mm. So next Thursday night, myself, Sean... Andrew, oh, God, my stomach hurts thinking about it. Yeah, Andrew from the Luau, hashtag Larry. Um, who else is in on this? Oh, um, Pops Ko, uh, Kristen, Kristen, and Alex, and Alex from This and That Essentials. <laughs> oh my God, we'll be doing Thank this. Thank you. I have like nearly snarted myself many times. Is that, is that the right <laughs> term? Sneeze and fart at the same time? Yeah, but then you like poop your pants afterwards. What would that be called? Uh, Shenarding. Shenarding. Yeah. Yeah. Kazi, you, you've you been with daddy. He's been shenarding all week. <laughs> <laughs> so that thing is going to suck. However, it's a regular size gummy. The packaging is I'm, large. I will not be actually ingesting it. I will be chewing it up in my mouth and then spitting it out. Spitters or quitters. Um, I cannot allow that to get into my stomach. Not after what the chip did to my stomach. It's thirteen I'm, and a half million scovels. Yeah, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna chance it. That's the gummy bear. Just a tiny little gummy bear. It's just a regular gummy. It's. Freaking uh, 15 calories for that little tiny gummy bear. Uh, we'll be doing that on a live stream on Andrew's channel. So the Luau next Thursday night, I believe at nine, 10, nine, your time, nine, my, yeah, nine central, uh, 10 Eastern. 
So be on the lookout for that. Bolo. Um, that ought to be a very interesting night because it's the first time we will see Larry actually try to back up some of his smack talk. I don't know, Elizabeth. So Larry came to visit me and ate a salad. All right. <laughs> Larry, you're going to want more than salad in your stomach before the guy will be able to eat this thing. Larry still hasn't eaten the spicy noodles. Plus, he says he has bleeding ulcers, so I don't know why he's eating this crap anyway. Uh, He's probably going to do the same thing I am. (laughs) He needed the fiber, Pop Couple says. Uh, I don't think there are any rules. Five minutes. You got to try to go five. I think you chew the thing you leave in your mouth for two minutes. Can you go a full five minutes without relief? No, I can't. I, I don't even want to do the stupid thing. <laughs> didn't we agree to this before the chip, didn't we? I don't remember, honestly. I I would not eat it. It's way too hot. Um, I think Ohana just did it. What did she say about it? What? What did she say about it? I haven't seen the video yet. I saw her post it on Instagram. Oh. I'm getting all choked up just thinking about it. Ohana <laughs> does mean family. Thanks, Devin. JJ said he heard it's not that bad. Yeah, did Larry tell you that? <laughs> yeah, that seems to be the consensus with Larry. Larry said no good. Drink for two minutes and then no drink for five. Sweet chili sour cream. Mm-hmm. Were those in the box too? Yep. <laughs> How come I don't get any of the good stuff? Um, the, I ate one of the hottest wings at B-Dubs once and couldn't feel my face. Glad it was my last wing. Uh, What's the hot one there? Blazing? That doesn't even come close to some of the stuff we've been eating. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> had some Reaper jerky today and had instant regrets. Regerts. Regerts, excuse me. And got them regerts. I'll be regerts and that stuff all over the place. <laughs> Guzzy, what's in your mouth? Okay. Come here. Oh, shit, Devin. Did you get some for yourself? Or is this just for the two of us? What is just the two of us? Oh, gross. We can make it if we try. Why do we have to eat all the crap? Brian will probably, Brian, quit lying. He would probably like the salted herring gummies. This boy, if you gave him salted herring, he'd probably eat it. And he wants to get the fish in the jar. Larry, the gummy bear is not nine mil, it's 13 and a half. Isn't it? I don't remember. I thought it was 10, but I, I, I don't know. It's called Little Nitro, right? Yeah. Devin, did you get some for yourself? I said 9 million, actually. I thought Andrew kept saying 13 and a half. I thought he did, too. Back of the box says 9 million. The box, the box doesn't say nothing. Larry says it's on the back of the box. Says oh, it does. Nine million. Our signature nine million Scoville unit. Chili axe strip. Well, how much is the chocolate? Six and a half. Oh. So Devin said, yeah, I'll eat it. Yeah, so that's that's not the, the proper rating if they're just saying that's the chili extract. Because... <laughs> Thanks, Andrew. Because he is that fun toy. Yeah. You want to show everybody what you got here? Andrew bought Kazi this Kong toy that doesn't actually have a squeaker in it. It just has like an intake valve that makes squeaky sounds. So when you squeeze it and let it go. Yeah. Any air that passes through it squeaks it. That's fantastic. <laughs> he doesn't have to chew it or anything. He could just step on it or it could bounce. Like if it bounces, it does make squeakies. Get it, Kazi. Get it, buddy. Right there. 
I want to try this garlic hot sauce. Chap, if you think that's a butt plug, I don't know what is going on in your life. <laughs> yeah. but you are probably shitting pancakes, my friend. <laughs> They're supposed to taper, Chap. Taper. <laughs> yeah, Chap likes the awfully aggressive ones. <laughs> Chap's dom is a dick. Yeah, Chap, uh, that's not like a little friendly visitor anymore. That's a freaking home invasion right there. <laughs> What? In terms of entry? Oh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you have your little friendly visitor. Or yeah. You have your home invasion. <laughs> Bye, Jeremy. Ooh, this smells really good. Hi. I got the sticker mule hot sauce. Did you? It came for free with 50 die cut stickers for 19 bucks. Like, I don't know if I'm like, oh, you know, that sticker company, they make a really good hot sauce. <laughs> so many people make hot sauce, though. I'll try it. It's pretty good. Actually. If it's good, I, I'm pretty sure a lot of people have that kind of mindset where I imagine their sauce is not going to be super expensive. I don't even remember where the hell we... Oh, no, your brother gave this to me, didn't he? I can't remember. Yeah, your brother gave this to me. The demolition project. Yeah, I can. It's uh, large. I might actually have to start using that one. What do you mean? I've been laying around when I'm here. Actually, mm -hmm. I was laying around yesterday at my mom's house, too. So Cosmo has gotten, like, super used to me just, like, hanging out with him, watching TV all day. So I think he's jealous that I'm, like, up and, you know, talking to someone that's not him. <laughs> Sorry, Cosy. The jalapeno one is the best, Larry. I love that. Yeah, I gave Andrew and Larry uh, jalapeno and chipotle hot sauces. That jalapeno huh. one is what I use on almost everything. Yeah. We should try Satan's blood. That sounds disgusting. Uh, yes. Why? Why do you guys want us to try all these things that sound really not good? Nobody's ever like, hey, you guys should go to this steakhouse and, you know, get a, you know, prize well, out of this. I mean, Devin is going to take us to dinner at a really nice restaurant in Seattle. So I'll eat the herring gummies. Yeah, but Devin also made me bet the over. Well, who there? Brittany heard all of that conversation yesterday. You liar. I'm not gonna lie, I didn't help because I was like, dude, if I had a thousand bucks, I'd be putting it on the over. Hey, <laughs> you calm down. I would have put a thousand on the over for that game last night. I would have lost. Yeah, I would have lost. We lost. No, I am not going to eat a salad. Well, I mean, I might eat a salad, but it won't be the only thing I eat. Yeah, there you go. Sean might toss one too. <laughs> Depending on the corn content. Yep. <laughs> I do like to monitor what my playthings eat first. Cuzzy, why are you so crazy? <laughs> oh. He doesn't like if you make raspberries at him. <laughs> the New Orleans game. Wasn't it? No, not the New Orleans game. Yeah, it was yeah. the New Orleans game. The Saints game. Falcons. No more barking, big boy. No more barky. <coughs> Tornadoes hit Phoenix? What? I don't know. Hey, South Georgia. Mike volume, yeah. When he barks, it goes down. All right. Well, down, I, guess. I mean, we've been on for like two hours. Almost two I'm hours. I'm good. So... Yeah, I dog, uh, dog invasion. Cosby has had enough of Sean's shenanigans. He demands that he lays down. He wants me to go lay in the bed and watch TV. I mean, is that not what you're about to go do? It's exactly what I'm about to go do. <laughs> Although I finished Dragon Ball Super. Yeah. Caught up on the last episode of Mandalorian. I'll be watching that shortly. The, ch the child. The child. 
Brian has a baby shark do rag on. It's a spastic pops hat. No <laughs> more Phoenix trips. I don't blame me on that one. All right, you guys. Well, thank you for watching us stuff our face and pull crappy pops. Except for Sean. I got a beast. And Cosmo knocked it over somewhere back there. <laughs> so. Yes. I think it was Lori. No, it wasn't Lori. Somebody wanted the beast. Yes. Whoever wanted the beast. Let me know. Pop couple wanted the Hulk. Yep. Brian wants the Sauron. Yes. Kazi, get Back out of here, you dig it. Um, the white Gandalf the White comes out at Hot, Hot Topic. Topic. Gandalf the White. Yep. Have you not seen that pop yet? Mm -mm. Dude. Oh, I don't think we ever showed our Gandalf on the bird. It was in a video. Oh, I haven't edited it yet then. Why are you bringing white into this? <laughs> Come on, bud. There you go. Look, I need daddy love. Help me. Give us one second, Kazi. I'm not getting enough daddy love. Hi. Yes. Hi. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Right there. Brian right. decided he didn't want to do shots. Hey, stop. Stop. Hey. Yeah, it's just one of the, it, it, we're taking it easy this week. Okay. It's been a long week. Yeah. Even yeah. though most of us have been on vacation. Kristen Lang wanted the beast. Thank you, Pop Couple. Kazi, you come down. Uh, top. Top one right here. Come down. Okay. Come down. There you go, Sean. Can you see it? I can. He's got his sword. <coughs> his staff, I think. Do you have the one where he's got the the hat on from the Hobbit? No. We we have not we're just now starting on the Hobbit collection. Um, you, which ones do you have? None. <laughs> You're full of shit. We have. I sent you the invisible Bilbo, didn't I? You said you were going to. Oh, maybe it's in the pile out there. Hi. I thought we we have a Hobbit pop now. Do you have Gandalf with no hat? We have no Hobbit pops. No, because I said Sean's going to send it to us, and you were like, uh-oh. Yep, that means we're going to have to collect them. <laughs> Kazi. And I think Justin said he was putting one aside for us. Justin, Bilbo. Justin's putting aside Bilbo, yes. yes. And I'm sending invisible Bilbo. Yeah. Yes. So we're you guys benefit greatly Bilbo. from me doing damage mystery boxes, because I just send you anything you like. <laughs> it's um, great. Stop chewing daddy. Better a Bilbo than a butt plug? Sure. That's where I was going. That's what rhymes with Bilbo. <laughs> dildo doesn't rhyme with Bilbo. <laughs> You're a dildo. <laughs> so what right. are you crying for, you dingus? Yeah. All right. I need to step up and deal yep. with my baby. No problem. Thanks, everybody, for showing up, hanging out. I know it wasn't. Uh, I know it wasn't as entertaining because I'm not drunk <laughs> and doing stupid crap. But uh, we appreciate it. Aggressive dabs, aggressive uh, dabs, uh, and uh, motorboating. Yes. But uh, love the bitches. <laughs> <laughs> guys, bye. bye.